the first pay-as-you-drive scheme has been launched in the West Midlands. CoWheels is government-funded and is designed to help motorists who can't afford their own cars. It's being introduced in rural Shropshire at a time when petrol prices are soaring. Ben Godfrey reports. Julia Walling is fed up of rising petrol prices, so she's decided to pay as she drives. She signed up with CoWheels, booking this car for work to take people on woodland trips around Ludlow. Drivers pay £25 to join the scheme. Then there are charges of £4.50 an hour, plus 21 pence per mile. The petrol's covered, as is tax and insurance. I think it's going to be cost effective. In some cases, I might have had to have hired a minibus, but not use it to full capacity. This would work well. Rising petrol prices are hitting rural drivers hard, with fuel costing up to two pence a litre more in the countryside than in towns and cities. When you're a member, you get a smart card like this, and to get into the car, you hold the card over the reader. It's been calculated that if you do less than about 8,000 miles a year, it's actually cheaper to use the pay-as-you-go cars, because obviously you're not paying all the overheads of tax and insurance. I think for young drivers it would be good for them because a lot of them can't afford their own cars. As far as I'm concerned, I don't see um, any advantage at all. CoWheels won't make a profit. It's funded via a government grant, so any income will be used to expand the service. But only if it's a success. For many people, a car is beyond reach, and that's the purpose of these schemes. But at the moment, let's, it's very early days. We've had 60 people who signed up in advance to say they'd like to use it. But if there's high demand early on, there could be a shortage. The government's funding has only covered the cost of two cars in Ludlow and five in Shrewsbury. Ben Godfrey, BBC Midlands Today, Shropshire. We're staying in Ludlow now, where three homes